That may have been closer to three quarters of an inch right there. That's 29 thousandths. I am close enough. So that's my taper this way. Now my width has got to be 0.488 back here and 0.481 right there. So now that I know my taper is correct, it's got to be 286 on the back. Well, this Turkish walnut machines so well. Point four eight eight. Right now I've got point four six nine. That is point seven seven one seven four. So I need to take it off of this side. I need to go another nineteen thousandths. Point four eight four. I'm four thousandths too small still. I'm still not quite deep enough. Okay, the width is good. We'll see about the depth. And then I've got to notch out that crescent shape. I wish I had some kind of a crescent shape bit to chew that out, but I just don't. I'm just going to have to cut it out with a bandsaw, rough it out, and then file it. I can file it and cut it with chisels. First I got to make sure my up and down is good because the shape of this crescent changes whether you move it up or down. The, the shape of that crescent is only one shape in one place. If you move it up or down it's different. So we'll be finding that out here in a few minutes. I've drawn an outline <clears throat> of where this metal this outline right here, I've drawn it on the back of this. And I'm going to cut that a little uh, a little closer to that outline. You can see that pencil mark. That way when I go to making my crescent, I know where the outside is because way out here it's hard to tell. Now I'm going to make a profile. And here again, this is kind of a just a sideways guess. I'm just going to try to draw a line. I'll have to cut that out, and refine that, and try to draw another one.
I have stayed away from that line intentionally. Trying to figure out the best tool to get in there and do that with. I know that there's some stuff in the middle here that's got to come out. This thing is really sitting in a bad position for me to work on it. That's really close for a, for a first time. I think I need to start smoking it and cutting it with a chisel. Kind of hard to see where it's hitting. There's a little trust area right there where that is kind of beefed up a little bit. And I'm having to cut that out. Relieve that because it, it sits right in here. Still got to go about a 30 second straight in that way. Just straight forward. Put some smoke on this thing. I never was a smoker. Well, I'll take that back. I took two puffs when I was 12. Got my feel of it right away. But I tell you what, smoking a gun stock is the way to go. It's not the right shape file. I don't know that I own one that's the right shape. 
this may work. This is just a dowel rod with a bunch of paper rolled up around it. You can get it tight enough. Got it about the right shape. I'm just trying to smooth it up inside. Yeah, that's the part that nobody sees. I know. That's really, really close. 